So hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video And on this video, I'm bringing you guys another story That I'm going to share with you guys So, yeah, let's just get right into it, right? So this story didn't actually happen to me in school It's actually from, I went to Mexico Okay, so this happened to me when I was in Hermosillo, Mexico So yeah, it's pretty far off from where I live Actually, it's like four hours off What happened is that we were basically at a market We were just chilling right there and this freaking guy, he was like fighting, I think, with some other dude, he got some beef with him, I don't know. What he does, he pulls out a freaking gun on him. Like, what the hell, who does that? He freaking pulled a gun at me. Not, not at me, but like, that at the guy. Why would anybody pull a gun at me? So he starts shooting, like, pam, pam, but he didn't actually hit the guy, I don't think. He starts shooting, like, hell crazy, so... We were, at this point, I was inside my car, ducking down, freaking praying that he wouldn't shoot me or my family. Dude, I was freaking scared at me. Who wouldn't be? Who, who wouldn't be scared in that situation? He was literally shooting it, like, randomly. Like, that guy was crazy. He probably played too much GTA. So then after that, he, like, shoots randomly. He was obviously going to hit somebody with a bullet, and that's what happened. But I don't think nothing bad happened to the guy. We just, like, drove by, like, freaking fast. We just freaking went out, like, freaking faster than Flash. We just freaking drove, bam, like, 100 miles per hour out of that freaking place when the shooting stopped like the sounds we just went back so we just went back and saw that there was a guy actually laying in the ground like i thought i thought he was dead but i don't think he actually was dead which is a good thing so yeah there was blood all over the place and i'm pretty sure they called the ambulance already so we didn't have to do that so the ambulance came and they took the guy you know obviously pretty sure they thought he was dead but he wasn't because he was moving up to the freaking ambulance so of course they had to call the police on the guy that shot him so this is where the crazy part starts of course we were driving by where the guy was and like we saw the guy that shot him like we already knew his face because we saw him when he pulled out the gun and like we were following him freaking cops came like five car cops came and it was freaking intense so like at this point the freaking place was just bombarded with cop cars and cops like ready to shoot the guy so what the guy did is that like, he entered the house I think he thought this was GTA or something, I don't know, because you can't just enter a house and get rid of cops, like this is not GTA. So he got a freaking bat, okay, a bat, and he started smashing a car. Of course, the police got on on him, but like, this guy was not giving up. He entered the house again, like this guy legit thought he was in GTA, god damn it, dude. So some time passed, of course. And the cops already had destroyed the door of the house he was hiding in. And I highly doubt it was his house. Poor owners of the house, they had to come to a freaking broken door and cops filled all over their yard. So that guy, of course, he had to come out of the house. He was already arrested by the cops. Like his face, I think the cops actually beat him up. So he was already arrested. His face was bleeding and everything. He resisted a lot. Like it took the like, cops like 30 minutes to arrest him. So yeah guys, that's the video. See you guys in the next video. Like and subscribe if you want to. Let's say let's say for 1 million likes. Cause why not? So yeah. Guess I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.